guys, what is up? It is Ro with another video. Welcome back, people of Earth. What is up? I dropped a video weeks ago of ranking all AMC theater foods. So I decided to keep that trend with a different movie theater today, but it's also a little bit different as well. Today I'm going to be ranking Alamo Draft House brunch menu. I think this was a 2021 feature. They started doing brunch screenings and I went to the French Dispatch brunch screening and they have a special brunch menu that you can order from. I realized that I tried the entire brunch menu and I wanted to do this video as a starter to a two-part video I'm going to make about Alamo later in the month of June and I'm really really excited. I'm going back to Alamo in the month of June so after that trip I can take out my part one but since I realized that I tried the entire brunch menu, I was like, let me rank the brunch menu as a pregame to the next videos that are going to come out about Alamo. There are only three items, so there's not that many. And I'm not going to be mentioning drinks because all of them are alcohol and I can't drink alcohol like soda anymore. I have the brunch menu here. I can't find the brunch menu online, like the explicit brunch menu. But I did take a picture and I actually do remember I ranked these <laughs> on my story, but why not make it a video? My caption is blocking it but a hatch chili breakfast tacos. I don't see the entire description. I don't know what it says, but you order two of these. You can choose from bacon, egg and cheese or potato, egg and cheese, which is the vegan option. And sorry, vegetarian option. And then it comes with homemade salsa and chips. It comes with chips. Then you have the French toast, decadent French toast topped with mixed berries, powdered sugar and maple syrup. And then the fried egg BLT, good morning sunshine, fried egg, bacon, romaine, lettuce and tomato served on Texas toast with fries. So coming in at third place is the Hatch Chili Breakfast Tacos. I'm not a huge fan of tacos in general. When I'm craving them, I'll eat them, but it's not a food I gear towards a lot of times. Like very, very rarely. I'm just not a really fan of tacos. Breakfast tacos, I'm not a huge fan of either. I love breakfast burritos more, but these are really good. They come on corn tortilla, if I'm not mistaken, and they're wrapped in this Foil. I remember they're wrapped in the foil, served in their beautiful black plate. The chips and salsa are delicious. Chips never go wrong. The flavor is there, but it's a bit dry. I tried bacon, egg and cheese, and potato, egg and cheese. The vegetarian one is obviously more dry because potato is also a hard texture, but the bacon, egg and cheese is really good. I wish they had a sausage option. I feel like sausage would bring a little bit more flavor to it, but it wasn't nasty. None of these items are nasty, but I ordered the Hatch Chili Breakfast Tacos again. Not necessarily. Number two is the French toast. French toast doesn't rank that high in breakfast foods. Number one is pancakes, two is waffles, then it's French toast. But this French toast, it's the spot. You don't need banana in this. I love banana in my French toast, but it's very, very sweet, but not too sweet that it becomes overwhelming. What I would have liked is some whipped cream on top. I just love my French toast loaded, but for not being a huge French toast gal and not being a huge fan of them in most places, this one is really freaking good. I'm a huge sweet person. When I eat breakfast out, I love two things on my plate, as in I love the savory and the sweet, so I'll order an omelet and then I would get a side of pancakes. The portion size is very big. There's three thick slices of toast, but what's funny is I say three thick slices of toast and I mean thick in the sense that it's big, but the toast is actually medium sized. It's not too big and it's not very really skinny. Just thinking about it makes me want to go back to a brunch screening. Number one is the fried egg BLT. So freaking good. Oh my gosh. I'm a huge fan of breakfast sandwiches, so maybe I'm biased. Like on an English muffin, on a bagel, on sourdough, on wheat, on anything. I love breakfast sandwiches. And I think they put mayo mixed with something else because it doesn't say there's like an aioli sauce in there, but there's this sauce in the sandwich that makes it so freaking good. Dip it in ketchup and ranch. And I also love that it comes with fries. I'm obsessed with Alamo's fries. Oh, don't get me started because I'm gonna derail onto another item at Alamo's menu that I freaking love the fries, but it's special kind of fry. The lettuce works so well. I love veggies on my breakfast sandwiches. So tomato, lettuce, onions, onions would have slapped hard. And if they had a sausage option, I would love to try the sausage, but the bacon is beautiful. Dip it also in barbecue. When I go to Alamo, I order three sauces, ranch, barbecue, ketchup. And then sometimes I would ask for honey mustard. And that is my ranking of Alamo's brunch screenings. I really do wish they had more options on the brunch screening, though I definitely understand if not. The kitchen is grinding all day. Thank you to all the workers who work at Alamo, the kitchen, the staff, the ushers, everyone. So I understand the stress it would be to add more stuff on the menu. If you have not tried Alamo's food yet, go. And if not, go to the brunch screening. I freaking love Alamo. Oh my gosh, should I rank movie theaters next? 
Okay, guys, that's all for today's video. If you love to give it a thumbs up, if you hate to give it a thumbs down, if you like more thumbs up, press the subscribe button, subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you all next video, which will probably not be Alamo themed, but I am excited for the videos that are coming that are Alamo themed. I cannot wait.